Hi, I'm Joey De Leon Jr. I was born and raised in New York City, mainly the Bronx. And I also lived in Jersey for a couple of years, during which uh, my interest in percussion really rose. Um, also having a long list of uh, family members that also played percussion. Uh, one very famous family, namely the Mangual family, uh, was very instrumental in my becoming a musician, as well as my father, who uh, later on uh, joined the LP company in the early 70s. He also played with a band that was very popular at the time called uh, Bobby Rodriguez y La Compañía. Um, a very, very distinct individual sounding band, as it was in the 70s in New York City, where every band really had something stylistically fresh and new to offer. Um, well, during that time, as I was you know, growing up and honing my skills, uh, I gathered an interest in, in uh, classical percussion, um, in which uh, I guess my sophomore year, I started to take xylophone lessons and timpani lessons. Consequently, next, the following year, I also uh, was able to audition for the Manhattan School of Music Preparatory Division, which is just a, a pre-college division before you enter. Anyway, I, I struck a, a great relationship with my teacher then, uh, Mr. Jeff Krause, and uh, prepared me toward the next year in, uh, into the uh, entrance into Manhattan School of Music, which uh, thank God I was able to make and I graduated and uh, I'm very lucky to have uh, received a, a very important uh, distinction and that was the most outstanding musician uh, out of my class in 1986. And uh, it's an honor that I'm, I still carry strongly to this day. Um, anyway, later, a uh, couple years, was doing a lot of traveling, doing a lot of uh, off-Broadway stuff. Uh, I decided to move to California, actually late 1992. Uh, took a couple of years off and uh, rediscovered my, my, my love for drumming again and back in 1995. And so pretty much since 1995, I got back into playing. And uh, my interest in congas really always, you know, just was always with me, but as well, other instruments had also come into uh, contact in my life. Uh, aside from all the Latin traditional instruments, Brazilian instruments, uh, also gotten a little bit into somewhat the electronic world a little bit. Um, so, you know, one thing in out, out here in California is you have to be quite well versed in a lot of different areas, not just, uh, not just the drums, but truthfully in my heart, this is what I love to do.